There's some things I say out of my mouth. Oh, this is how people do it. Whenever it is that my mouth is not mature <clears throat> and my mouth is not meek, look at this. I try to intimidate people with, with yelling or rants or threats. This is, this is, Jesus, there was no guile in his mouth, no guile in his mouth. He never tried to intimidate with yelling or threats. He never, he never tried to shame with, with humiliation or guilt trip. People, you know, people try to guilt you, try to guilt you to do what they want you to do. Let me show you some other verbal abuse. Silence with, with, with constant interruptions or changing topics. Whenever you're trying to deal with something, trying to, trying to bring something to somebody's attention, and they don't want to hear what you got to say. Come on, somebody doing it in their mind right now. They don't want to hear this. They were bubbling in their mind. They, they arguing with me in their mind. I ain't even there. I ain't, they arguing with their mind. They don't turn. They don't, come on, chef, before you go. They already went. They gone. They looking at something else. <laughs> Silence with constant interruption. But, 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 here's my favorite, but you don't understand. Can I get it? Come on, can you sit up, sit up. I don't have to. He understands. <laughs> That's a whole other message. Let me get out of here. De 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 when I get mad, de degrade with, 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 with public or private put down. Control with criticism or sarcasm. Devalue by demeaning family or friends. Belittle by mocking or name calling. Overpower by always claiming to be right. Never wrong. I'm talking to the meek. <laughs> It's empowered by continually, look at this, dictating orders. Disrespect by denying that the abuse ever happened. <clears throat> Here's something that's so, that helped me in my marriage. This changed, this changed my marriage. And I learned to stop telling my wife how she should feel. If she said I disrespected her, if I feel like I didn't disrespect her, it's irrelevant. I can't feel for her. Get out of here. I'm gone. Let me get out of here. I'm gone. <clears throat> say, say a little bit. You can't tell a person how they feel. If, come on. What would the, the meek say? Even if I know you off your rocker. Come on here. Even if I know that you just, you're just trying to pick something to bother me or just trying to come up against me. What does it matter? The meek takes a low roll and I'll apologize. Come on. I, I, you know what? I, I didn't realize what it was I was saying. I didn't know that what I was saying was offense to you. I, I don't, don't let my words cripple you or hurt you. I apologize. That's what the meek do. Even if I don't agree with what you're saying, I can't tell you how to feel. I can't write off your feelings say well you need to grow up when well, that's still bothering you you still talking about that on behalf of everyone here at truth and love ministries we want to thank you for being a part of our online worship experience thank you for your participation through your likes your shares and your comments but we also want you to participate when it comes down to helping us continue to push this gospel message forward you can do so by downloading our app and you can give there in a safe and secure way you can go to our website at truthandlove.tv and you can give or you can text the word T-I-L Jax to the number 77977. Thank you so much for your generosity. Thanks for watching. Be blessed. See you next time.